Tonight, it's a Labor landslide. Voters in Victoria deliver Daniel Andrews a stunning victory. Matthew Guy's coalition reeling, losing half its seats and suffering a backlash in the bush. This is 10 News First, Melbourne, with Jennifer Kite. Good evening. The Andrews government has been returned with a huge majority. Voters brutal in their verdict. The Labor Party headquarters in Mulgrave now, where Daniel Andrews is addressing the crowd. Can I pay a special thank you? Can I offer a special thank you to each and every volunteer, each and every member of our Community Action Network? Can I also make a very special mention of all of those members of the trade union movement? A very jubilant Daniel Andrews there. And our reporters are with both parties. We have Nick Etchells at the Labor headquarters. Nicole Strawn is with the Liberals. We'll go to Nick Etchells first. Nick, what a stunning victory for Daniel Andrews. Jen, you might almost say that stunning is not strong enough a word. I was speaking to some of Daniel Andrews' staff uh, just before he arrived here. They're a pretty optimistic bunch. They could not believe what they've seen tonight. And while tonight is not our night, we know that. We acknowledge that. We accept that. Our time in the sun will come again. Thank you very much. But, Jen, in that speech, Matthew Guy gave no indication about whether he will stay on as Liberal leader. OK, thank you very much, Nicole. Now, let's take an in-depth look at tonight's remarkable result. Our expert analyst, Sean Salmon, from Bastion Engage, joins me now. Sean is a former political advisor to the Rudd-Gillard Federal Labor Government. It's good to have you with us, Sean. Thanks. Now, defeat was on the cards for the Coalition, but no-one expected quite this size. If they did, they certainly didn't tell anyone because this is a landslide is almost being polite. Not since 2002 has Victoria seen this sort of political change and even then it was a change of party. This time it's just a government being re-elected but so prominently winning 14, up to 60 seats, which is a 14. It's, it's huge. OK, Sean, really appreciate your insight tonight. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. OK. And that's our 10 News First Election Saturday. We'll be back tomorrow from 6pm with the wash-up from this election. For now, on behalf of the team, good night.